Hello everyone, and welcome to today's video, where we'll be exploring the fascinating history and design of the Lantern Rondash weapon. This unique weapon, popular among soldiers in the Middle Ages, combines a sword and shield, making it an effective weapon for both offensive and defensive purposes. In this video, we'll take a closer look at the history, design, and use of the Lantern Rondash, and see why it was such a popular weapon among soldiers and fighters. The Lantern Rondash has its roots in medieval Europe, specifically in the 14th century. During this time, there was a need for weapons that could be used for both offensive and defensive purposes. Soldiers needed a weapon that could be used to strike their opponents and protect themselves at the same time. This need led to the development of the Lantern Rondash. The design of the Lantern Rondash was influenced by the Italian weapon known as the Spadone, which was a two-handed sword. The Spadone was popular among soldiers and was used in many battles. The Lantern Rondash was designed to be a more versatile version of the Spadone, combining the qualities of a sword and a shield. The Lantern Rondash has a unique design that sets it apart from other weapons. It has a long blade that is about 36 inches in length and a broad shield that is about 22 inches in diameter. The shield is attached to the sword blade with a metal bar, which allows the user to hold the weapon with one hand. The shield is shaped like a lantern, hence the name Lantern Rondash. The shield is curved and has a protruding point at the top. This design allows the user to use the shield to block attacks from their opponents and also use it to strike their opponents. The blade of the Lantern Rondash is straight and sharp, allowing the user to use it for thrusting and slicing attacks. The handle of the weapon is designed to be comfortable to hold and provides a secure grip for the user. The Lantern Rondash was used by soldiers in battles and tournaments. Its unique design made it a versatile weapon that could be used for both offensive and defensive purposes. The shield provided protection for the user while the sword blade could be used to strike opponents. In battles, soldiers would use the Lantern Rondash to fight against their enemies. The shield would be used to block attacks from the enemy, while the sword blade would be used to strike the enemy. The long blade of the weapon was also useful for thrusting attacks, allowing the user to attack their opponent from a distance. In tournaments, the Lantern Rondash was used in sword fights. The shield provided protection for the user, while the sword blade was used to strike their opponent. The Lantern Rondash was a popular weapon in tournaments because of its unique design and versatility. So that's it for today's video on the Lantern Rondash weapon. We hope you enjoyed learning about the history and design of this fascinating weapon. The Lantern Rondash is a unique weapon that showcases the creativity and ingenuity of medieval weapon makers. Its versatility and effectiveness in battle made it a popular choice among soldiers and fighters, and its historical significance continues to be admired today. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.